Welcome everyone to the virtual President's Leadership Dessert. While this event would have typically occurred on campus, we're thankful for the opportunity to come together to honor our outstanding student leaders on our campus. We hope you grab your dessert to enjoy as well for our program. And we hope you are all doing well and in good health. And as we uh, go forward, uh, we want to obviously say our appreciation to all of you for being so resilient during this very different semester as it draws to a close. I am joined this evening by Dr. Adrian Thompson Bradshaw, Dean of Students and Vice President for Student Affairs to assist with the presentation of these awards this evening. This event is hosted annually by Omicron Delta Kappa, the National Leadership Honor Society with over 300 students, faculty, staff, and alumni typically in attendance. The event is also sponsored by Student Senate. We appreciate their support and involvement for this event, and I'm grateful that you have joined us this evening virtually. We look forward to the day when students can return to campus and to this event occurring in person again next year. Tonight, we will be presenting nine individual student awards honoring Dr. DeBeau Freed and his wife, Catherine Freed. And in addition, the Student Organization of the Year Award sponsored by Student Senate. But we begin with the award presentation for the Newman Civic Fellowship. It is my pleasure to announce the ONU student who is receiving this honor. The Newman Civic Fellowship is a one-year fellowship which is sponsored by Campus Compact a national organization that promotes community service among college students. Receiving the award this year is Madison Carpenter. Madison is a junior majoring in political science and philosophy. She has made a great impact at ONU during her time here through involvement in Amnesty International, Residence Life Staff, and the Arts and Science Student Advisory Board. Madison is the sixth ONU student to win this prestigious honor. Congratulations, Madison. We are proud of you and all that you continue to do for ONU. Congratulations, Madison. The Student Organization of the Year Award recognizes student organizations for outstanding work each year. We will announce the overall winner tonight and Student Senate will announce the category award winners via social media. This year's winner is a long-standing member of the campus community with popular long-standing trips and experiences for their 102 members. The mission of the group is to serve and they recorded over 2,500 service hours among their five main projects this year. The Alice K. Hildebrand Student Organization of the Year Award goes to Habitat for Humanity. Congratulations, Habitat. The Catherine Freed Outstanding Senior Female Leadership and Service Award will be presented this evening to honor the legacy of an amazing ONU woman, Catherine Freed. The award will be presented to a female student who has had a significant positive impact on the Ohio Northern Campus, in addition to service to their community. This year's winner was compared to Catherine Freed in the nomination letter written by a faculty member. And I quote, she is a positive role model to her peers, an effective team player and sought after team member in the classroom, end quote. She can be seen around campus in a variety of roles, ranging from residence life to aid of friends, in addition to her involvement in the Dickey College, as well as a health-wise yoga instructor. Congratulations to Hannah Smith, Senior Management Major, for receiving the Catherine Freed Outstanding Senior Female Leadership and Service Award. Congratulations, Hannah. The next awards will be present, we will be presenting will be in honor of President Emeritus Dr. Debo Freed. The Debo Freed Awards for Outstanding Leadership as an undergraduate student will be presented to eight individuals. The awards are in honor of the legacy of the late Dr. DeBeau Freed. The award will be presented to eight individuals, one male and one female from each class year on campus who have a significant positive impact on Ohio Northern University. 
We will begin with the first year female award. This individual is already making her mark on campus. According to a faculty member, quote, she is one of the most positive and outgoing students I have ever encountered, end quote. Another faculty member wrote, quote, I am blown away that a young lady with such extensive involvement in so many other campus and community activities still maintains such an outstanding overall GPA, earning her a place on the dean's list, end quote. Congratulations to Allison Hoffman, first year public relations and communication major on receiving the first year female award. Like Allison, our first year male recipient is a strong and admired leader. He is involved in a variety of areas on campus, including marching band, jazz band, Amnesty International, and College Democrats, just to name a few. According to his nominator, quote, I think he has a bright academic future at Ohio Northern, and I have seen him pushing his peers to do well in their academic pursuits, end quote. Congratulations to Zachary Wiles, first year political science major on receiving this award. The second year female recipient is known by many through her leadership. One faculty member wrote about her, quote, it is often said that enthusiasm is contagious. Those elementary students believed that this activity was the most exciting thing in her life. And consequently, it became an equally exciting event in their lives. She taught, she encouraged, she inspired, and she showed them genuine love, end quote. Congratulations to Alyssa Sayer, a mechanical engineering major, on receiving the second year female award. This leader came to ONU with many involvements and awards and has continued on the same path. A faculty mem member commented about all of his skills, but even went further stating, quote, the best thing about him is his personality. Yes, he is a leader and yes, he has some great skills, but you just like being around him. He has energy, enthusiasm, integrity, and he likes to have fun as well, end quote. Congratulations to Christopher Paff, a second year pharmacy student on receiving this award. The recipient of the third year female award has a long and impressive resume with many involvements and positions. According to her nominator, quote, I can truly say that I am blessed to have her in my life. With such optimism for living and passion for her profession, she is truly one special student at ONU, end quote. Congratulations to Anna S. Kender, a third year pharmacy student on receiving this award. Like Anna, our third year male recipient is a special student at ONU. According to the nominator, quote, he has held numerous leadership positions because simply put, he gets things done. I have gained tremendous amounts of respect for him this past year as I have serendipitously watched him in numerous settings, end quote. For the third year male award, congratulations to Preston Johans, a third year nursing student. The next award is presented to a female in her fourth year on campus. This individual can be described as wearing many different hats on campus, and she does them all with grace. According to her peer, quote, she has made a big impact on my life and lives of students all around the ONU campus, end quote. The fourth year recipient, female recipient is Zoe Schilling, a fourth year pharmacy student. Congratulations, Zoe. The final award is presented to a fourth year male. These words were shared from a faculty member. Quote, we have discussed the all in mentality when joining a group. If you believe in the organization, do not just be a member, be involved and be a leader or mentor to other members. He has taken the all in mindset to not only become truly involved with his fraternity and DCBA, but I also see his eagerness to grow and become a well-rounded individual, end quote. Congratulations to Brian Ruffini, fourth year accounting student for receiving this award. Congratulations to all of the award winners. Each winner will receive a monetary award 
as well as a framed certificate. The Office of Student Involvement staff will reach out to you soon with more information. In closing, I want to express my sincere congratulations to our award recipients. In addition, congratulations to the many students who were nominated for these awards. And thank you to the faculty and staff and students who took the time to write nomination letters for our process. We appreciate your joining us this evening for this virtual President's Leadership Dessert. Best wishes as you finish out the semester. We are very much looking forward to your return to campus for the fall semester. Until then, take good care and good luck on finals.